Hello friends, in this video we'll be discussing introduction to moments and moment generating function. Friends, in probability distribution we starting with a new topic you can say moments. Moment and moment generating function. This topic is very small and has few problems. So before going ahead let's start a discussion what exactly the formulas that will be required in this particular topic the first is raw moment or moment about origin it is given by mu r dash and the formula is expectation of x raised to r so this is the first formula if it is asked in the exam to find first four raw moments so first four raw moments will be you're going to replace r with 1 then r with 2 then r with 3 r with 4 always four moments asked in the exam so this is x raised to 1 this is if you replace r with 2 x square if you replace r with 3 that will be x cube and if you replace r with 4 that will be x raised to 4. e of x as discussed is summation of whatever is here we are going to write it down here px. If it is x square I am going to write it down x square into px. If it is x cube I am going to write it down x cube. And finally, if it is x raised to 4, I am going to write it on the x raised to 4. So, these are the first four moments. They are called a raw moment or moment about origin. Second point is central moments or moments about mean central moment or moment about mean it is represented by mu r first is raw moments or moments about origin so we're going to get four moments by this formula and central moment is represented by mu r so if it is dash then that is raw moment if without dash then it is central moment now we'll see how to find it out four central moments mu1 mu2 mu3 and mu4 without dash Remember the trick. This is very important. If you follow this trick, the formulas will be very simple. Always remember first is 0, second is if you have mu2, mu3, and mu4. So mu2 dash, mu3 dash, mu4 dash. Clear till now? This is mu2. That means mu2 will contain two terms mu3 will contain three terms and mu4 will contain four terms with that mu1 dash is fixed again mu1 dash and finally mu1 dash here it is 2 therefore i am going to take square here it is 3 i am going to take cube here it is 4 i am going to take 4 next mu2 will contain only term two terms we got two terms mu2 is done mu3 will contain three terms so see what i am doing just reduce this mu3 by one so that will be mu2 dash with that remember mu1 dash next mu4 mu4 will contain four terms so reduce mu4 dash by one that will be mu3 dash with that mu1 dash fixed again reduce mu3 dash with one so that will be mu2 dash mu1 dash square here it is mu1 dash again with mu1 dash one more so that will be mu1 dash square here are going to write it on 1 2 3 it will be alternate plus minus sign first is plus second is minus this is plus minus plus plus minus plus and minus here we have 1 this is 1 and this is 2 so here it will be 3 here first is 1 last is 3 will be 4 
here it is 3 here it is 2 multiply you will get 6 so this is the way you are going to form the formulas so through raw moments we got four central moments next formula is moment about any arbitrary point a is mu a r which is equal to expectation of x minus a raised to r if you want first moment then it will be e x minus a raised to 1 if you want second moment mu a 2 e x minus a the whole square if you want third moment e x minus a the whole cube and if you want the last moment mu a 4 that is expectation of x minus a raised to 4 so this is the third formula moment about any arbitrary point a fourth formula is moment generating function and the formula is m of t is equal to expectation of e raised to tx as discussed expectation is summation of x into px whatever you write here you're going to write it down here so e raised to tx into t of x so these are the four formulas that will be required while solving the problem based on moments and moment generating function the most important thing is to remember this trick this is very important hope you understood the formulas in the next videos we'll discuss how to use these formulas thank you